सो हे गाइज वेलकम बैक वन सेकेंड एंड इन टू डेज वीडियो आई एम जस्ट गो नॉट टॉक अबाउट अ सिंपल ट्रिक दैट यू कैन गो एंड मैस अराउंड एक्चुअली वन ऑफ माई व्यूवर जस्ट आज मी दैट हाउ अ पर्सन ऑन ब्रेडिट इज एबल टू कन्वर्ट अ सिंपल पी एन जी इन टू एंड आर्ट कवर स्टाइल एज यू कैन डेफिनेटली सी आई वॉज जस्ट मेसिंग अराउंड विद दिस थिंग एंड यूजिंग कंट्रोल नेट सेक्शन विद अ सिंपल पी एन जी डेफिनेटली विद कैनी प्री प्रोसेसर एंड अ कैनी मॉडल आई वॉज जस्ट एबल टू कन्वर्ट इन टू समथिंग लाइक दिस एंड लेट मी टेल यू दिस इज जस्ट अ सिंपल टेक्निक दैट यू कैन गो एंड मेस अराउंड इफ यू हैव PNG as well. Let me tell you guys, I will just mess around with text to image section as well, and I will also show with image to image section as well. So you can go on both of these section and yes, generate some amazing result as well. So first of all, let's start with text to image. As you can see, this was the prompt that I was using: octane render of logo style album cover. And this is important horror theme, and definitely you can go with like different different theme as well. And also you can go and add some of the details if you want. And yes, definitely I was also using. noise offset lora so first of all let's go with text to image and let's try to generate three more images and let's see what result do we get so guys as you can see these are the three result that i got with this theme and yes pretty amazing result as well if you see this result definitely amazing result i just love this result and yes you can go on changing prompt as well if you want to generate something different style then yes you can go on generate something like that but these are the result that i got pretty amazing i just love the result and let me tell you once again i was just using canny pre processor and canny model if i if you want then i can definitely check on to different as well we will go with scribble Let's go with scribble this time, and let's see what result do we get. Wait one, guidance start zero, and and this time we will go with something different theme. And this time I went on with blood dripping background, and yes, scribble preprocessor and scribble model. And let's see now what result do we get. So guys, as you can see, that are the result that I got with scribble model, and definitely amazing result as well. So yes, it's working quite like amazing, and yeah, you can go with changing models as well. So basically, I'm using dreamlike diffusion this time, and this was the result. that i got with scribble model once again what we will do we will just jump on to canny model let's go to canny model once again and this time i went on with different theme and this time multi color liquid dripping theme and that's the thing that i'm using and canny pre processor and canny model now let's see what result do we get so guys again with like different from multi color liquid dripping see these are the result that i got let me tell you guys one thing that i noticed canny is literally working great the reason why i said canny is literally working great first of all these are the canny result and let me tell you guys i was also using invert input color the reason to this is this is a white background and yes it is already said over here invert color if your image has a white background so that's why you can go and use invert input color and the result with canny are literally amazing you can definitely see let me show you see the uh, chrome logo over here this result i didn't got with scribble but yeah i might be wrong but definitely canny is working great for me and this is one way you can go and generate something let me tell you guys first of all prompt is also important you can go and changing prompt as well different different themes as well and yes definitely prompt matters as well and if you want to generate something with different thing then you can also go with image to image section let's send this to first of all let's send this to image to image section so after sending on to image to image section it will automatically load the prompt you no need to load the prompt here what we will do let me tell you here we will just remove this and we will add different image over here let's go with different image we will go with like this let's go with this image first of all and let's see we will experiment with this and let's see what result do we get what we will do here is that we will uh, we will turn on control net section on image to image we will add the image first of all add the background image this was the background image that i was using and we will turn on this also we will turn on this as well and low vram because i am using low vram and now what i will do let's go with canny only now what i will do first thing i will test on one let's go with max denoising strength and let's see what result do we get so guys as you can see these are the result that i got on image to image section and definitely guys one thing i learned is that and i always say on my video that control net section on image to image section performs really great compared to text to image if i show you these are the result that i got see the closely see the result closely you can definitely see amazing result and here as well this was the second result that i got pretty amazing result same prompt everything same just the only thing i added something over here some theme over here this has nothing effect right now but i will show you and the only thing that i did is that denoising strength to 1 
that's the only thing that i did and these are the result that i got if i compare it with text to image let me show you this way the result that i got with text to image these are amazing result as well definitely amazing result but if you see this result i just love this result let me know in the comment section below guys which results are great are this result great or text to image i definitely love this image great than text to image but yes again one thing that will definitely do is that let's decrease this to 0.5 this time we will only generate one image and with 0.5 denoising strength and now let's see what result do we get so guys as you can see after messing around with denoising strength with 0.5 denoising strength this is the result that i got and yes not a great result but you can definitely see the result is just similar to like this theme and yes definitely it just got merged with this image as well so that is the result that i got and that's why i love image to image section so as you can see over here same prompt multicolor liquid dripping background theme same prompt now once again what we will do we will just try to increase because on 0.5 we learned that this image has a lot of influence on the result so what we will do we will try to go with let's go with 7.5 and let's see now what result do we get so guys as you can see this is the result that i got let me show you once again it's a 0.75 denoising strength definitely so that is the result that i got and definitely amazing result as well let me tell you guys one thing that i just love image to image section as well in order to go with different style and you can go and mess around with different image on image to image input section as well let me tell you so if you go on messing with denoising strength then you can definitely get some amazing result as well so that's the result and that's the thing that i wanted to show you and yes let me tell you if you can go on text to image as well the result on text to image are also amazing definitely you can see and on image to image section as well but personally i will say that go with image to image section and that's the only thing just a logo over here enable in invert input color and canny preprocessor and canny model or you can go with different models as well if you wish but that's the thing that i wanted to show you so guys that's it for today i hope so guys you like this video and i will be back with more and more videos tomorrow till then have a good day bye guys love you all guys bye guys